Hello, everybody. Welcome to today's devotion for January 31st. Today's devotion is titled, Fully Surrendered to Christ. The Bible reading is from Mark chapter 8, verses 34 to 38. Then he called the crowd to him along with his disciples and said, Whoever wants to be my disciple must deny themselves and take up their cross and follow me. For whoever wants to save their life will lose it, but whoever loses their life for me and for the gospel will save it. What good is it for someone to gain the whole world, yet forfeit their soul? Or what can anyone give in exchange for their soul? If anyone is ashamed of me and my words in this adulterous and sinful generation, the Son of Man will be ashamed of them when he comes in his Father's glory with the holy angels. In 1920, John Sung, the sixth child of a Chinese pastor, received a scholarship to study at the university, at a university in the United States. He graduated with the highest honors, completed a master's program, and earned a Ph.D. But while pursuing his studies, he had walked away from God. Then, one night in 1927, he surrendered his life to Christ and felt called to be a preacher. Many high-paying opportunities awaited him back in China, but on the ship home, he was convicted by the Holy Spirit to lay aside his ambitions. As a symbol of his commitment, he threw all his awards into the sea, keeping only his Ph.D. certificate to give to his parents out of respect for them. John Sung understood what Jesus said about becoming his disciple. What good is it for someone to gain the whole world, yet forfeit their soul? As we deny ourselves and leave our old life behind to follow Christ and is leading, it may mean sacrificing personal desires and material gain that distract us from following him. For the next 12 years, John carried out his God-given mission wholeheartedly, preaching the gospel to thousands throughout China and Southeast Asia. How about us? We, may, we may not be called to be preachers or missionaries, but wherever God calls us to serve, by His Spirit working in us, may we fully surrender to Him. What do you need to surrender in order to truly follow Jesus? What are some personal ambitions you may be holding on to? Thank you for joining me for today's devotion, and I hope you all have a wonderful day.